Hi, this is Dr. Janes, and today we're going to talk about how to um, add the overdrive effect to your electric guitar through Audacity. Okay, so in order to hook our guitar up to the computer, we'll take our quarter inch jack, hook it up here. Okay. There's our guitar. Pretty rocking, huh? And I will. So. Have to figure out which one's the line input into the back of the computer. And we'll take our little jack adapter and we will plug that into the back of our computer. Then we'll be all set to record stuff with our audacity. So, I believe we have everything all set up here. So we'll hit uh, record and we'll start recording. Okay. And Let's uh, play that back to see how it sounds. Okay. So now we'll try to add some effects to it. Now what the overdrive is going to do is it's going to clip off the tops of the uh, the. Uh, Basically, the, the guitar signal will look like a sine wave if you zoom in on it. And uh, we want to clip off the tops of them so it will become more like a square wave and that will give the overdrive effect. Okay. Okay, so now we have our sound loaded into uh, the, the uh, Audacity. And uh, we'll play it one more time. different things we can do to this. Let's try just uh, adding a effect distortion. Okay, we're going to try hard clipping. We're just going to clip off the tops and the bottoms of the sine waves that are generated by the, the guitar signal. And so we'll apply that and we'll take a look at what we got. So now you can see all the uh, sine waves are clipped so they're really distorted and flat. Let's let's see how that sounds. Okay. Now we're rocking, huh? Shall shall we try adding some um, let's maybe add some echo to it. How about that? Try that, see how that sounds. Yeah, that didn't sound too good. We can undo the echo. Oh, uh, let's see. What else we got here? Maybe reverb would sound better. Let's add a little bit of reverb to it. All right, now we're really sounding good. Okay, so anyway, there's a lot of different things you can play with all these different dials and stuff. So uh, you don't have enough money to buy an effect pedal for your guitar, or you just want to be able to change the effects afterwards, add them into your music, you can do that all with Audacity. Okay, so I'm going to sign out for now, but we'll be making some more videos if people are interested in, in learning more about Audacity and how you can make music with it. Okay, this is Dr. Janes, and thanks for watching.